Hi guys, I'm Ksenia. Welcome to my channel St. Petersburg Me. And today I will tell you how Russians make coffee and tea. And without further ado, let's get to the topic. So first of all, let's start with the Soviet Union. I asked my mom how the things were going on with coffee and tea in the Soviet times. So she remembers uh, in her childhood the, that was like 60s, uh, their family didn't, uh, have, didn't have coffee. Uh, and uh, my mom remembers uh, she started drinking coffee only in 80s uh, but um, they were having coffee uh, for big celebrations for big family celebrations only and it was instant coffee now i remember uh, from my childhood in 90s that uh, people in belarus i lived at that time in belarus had only instant coffee and um, now um, i like my coffee um, to be brewed like boiled and of course at present there are many ways of making coffee either at home or like out outside like in in a cafe or uh, some some other place you can have your coffee in uh, different coffee makers coffee machines machines that use capsules everything that you like and everything to your taste and everything to your wallet of course you can buy different coffee makers, coffee machines, so the prices are like this, those are coffee makers, and different kinds of coffee machines. you will not be able to buy this for a salary you will have to save for a coffee machine for this one for example but still there are some different ways of making coffee in Russia okay today I will show you how I make coffee uh, I like my coffee mild and I like latte so i will show you how i make a latte i i don't have a coffee machine or a coffee maker at home because uh, this uh, this apartment is not a my apartment i rent it so i prefer to have as few things as possible because i sometimes i have to like move in and move out like a lot and that's why i want uh, to not to do the packing all the time and unpacking so guys now I have two ways of making coffee at home I think you must know this this way it's a mocha pot as I found the name I think you are aware of this one and this is called jazva this is a Turkish way of making coffee and I will show you how I make latte with jasva. So guys to make latte at home I need jasva, coffee, milk and I like my coffee spicy so I will take turmeric and some other spices. So guys two spoons of coffee here and now I'll add water and we also have to boil some some milk and guys I add spices to the milk not to the coffee to the milk a little turmeric just a little Guys, if you are watching this video from Italy, 
I understand this is not latte. You will never call this latte. But guys, we are in Russia. I'm in Russia and this is like latte a Russian style. And guys, I will tell you more. This is latte Xenia style. So that's why the coffee is mild and it is spicy. And I I hope I hope I will be able to travel to Italy and try real Italian latte. So modern Russians prefer drinking uh, both coffee and tea. Oh, our milk is ready already. And from time to time you need to stir your coffee. So when the coffee is ready, the coffee is ready right before the boil. Just watch your coffee and don't miss it. If you are watching this video from Turkey, please uh, write in the comments down below if I'm doing everything right with the jazva. If not, please give a recipe for a Turkish coffee. And now a finishing touch. Pouring some milk. And coffee. It's really good. Mm, I like it. And now guys, I will tell you how I make tea. Okay guys, to make tea you need a teapot, um, hot water, like very hot, boiling. And this water is going to boil right, right now. <laughs> uh, you need tea, you need herbs. Uh, sometimes I like my tea with uh, berries, for example, frozen strawberries or frozen cherries are my uh, favorite. And today I will be doing, uh, making my tea with um, this mix. This mix contains uh, balm, melissa, I don't know what you call melissa in English, but I found balm. In a dictionary. Uh, the leaves of strawberries, leaves of raspberries, leaves of um, currant, uh, leaves of wild strawberries, um, mint, and of course guys you can buy a lot of uh, different kinds of tea in um, stores, in grocery stores. Uh, Russians like uh, tea bags, um, and but I don't have tea bags in my kitchen because I don't like this kind of tea. I like uh, loose tea, so which you have to uh, to like to make in a teapot. So okay, let's start. I just need some loose tea. A little bit of loose tea. Then I will add some herbs mix. And boiling water. All you need for tea. So our water is boiling. And now we're pouring it in a teapot. So guys, this looks beautiful, just look. This kettle is not the only thing. I bought it with this plate, like uh, this plate is used for heating your tea. Uh, you have to lit a candle. I will show you how I do this. So I'm litting the candle, place it uh, in the into the plate so it oh my god looks like this 
and then I place my teapot on it and it prevents your tea of getting cold okay all right and sometimes I do some magic I will show you so I just switch lights and that's how I organize magic in the evening and drink tea and editing my videos or like making new scripts for new videos my second channel uh, I saw this uh, set uh, in a cafe when I was meeting my friends like uh, a long long time ago like maybe some years ago and I was always uh, thinking that oh that is so nice to have such a um, set with a tea but I didn't know that I actually could buy it <laughs> and this year I thought why not uh, looking it up um, on some marketplace like uh, online my marketplace and I did and there it was <laughs> so I bought it so that's how you can organize your magic in the evening <laughs> so very nice magic as for me I like coffee very much and I can end up having four cups of coffee every day um, but it's too much for me so I'm trying to get rid of this coffee habit and some people say like try uh, replacing it with chicory uh, like like this one so this is instant chicory and you can find um, many other ways of having this um, drink uh, chicory is tsikori in Russian so like people say oh chicory is like coffee but it's not <laughs> it's not chicory chicory is not coffee so guys, as I promised in my previous video, it's time for the giveaway. I bought some presents for you. This is uh, a poster featuring my um, hero. Uh, he is Yuri Gagarin. Uh, he is the first man in space. So I will um, randomly choose uh, a winner and send it to you. And um, this one this ones are key rings and a magnet so guys if you want to participate uh, you have to um, comply with uh, like three conditions so you will have to give this video a like leave a comment under this video and uh, to be subscribed for this channel so in the next video i will choose uh, four winners who will get the, these presents. So, good luck guys! This is all I wanted to tell you about coffee and tea in Russia and I hope this video was useful to you. If so, give it a like and see you in the next one. Bye guys!